this is like the third time I've filmed this video. I'm hoping it's the last one because I'm not trying to do this again. I filmed and posted two makeup tutorials, but I didn't end up liking them. No, just no. I know, it's kind of like, I kind of do my makeup differently now, kind of. So this is kind of like, it get ready with me because I'm going somewhere. I'm actually going somewhere, but at the same time, it's a makeup tutorial. I'm going to another 15 shocker. I'm not gonna vlog this time though, just because I've uploaded hella videos and I don't want my channel to be just vlogs and me going to Ginsis. All right, I'm gonna put in my contacts really quick. I haven't worn contacts in like a week, so my eyes are adjusting. Feels like it's poking. I'm gonna just put like these bobby pins in because no, I like my headband better. First thing we're gonna do, oh, I set it up my phone, but we're gonna moisturize and I use the CeraVe. I haven't done my makeup all week either because I'm on break right now. I wanna give my face a break from all that. Okay, now once we're done with that, we're gonna do our brows. And I'm actually gonna try something new today and I'm gonna see if I like it. Hopefully I do. So normally for my brows, I use, oh, I can't, I can't tilt it, it's gonna fall. But I normally use the like dark brown shades and I just finished using up this one so now I'm using this one but today I'm gonna try out I don't know I just found this in my mom's makeup so if I want to do the eyeshadow it honestly works just as fine but basically I use this um NYX or NYX brow glue to get the shape first and then I use this Anastasia brush this one the double sided one to obviously fill them in i kind of also wanted this video to be like a playlist video but i'm obviously recording on my phone and i don't have anything else but i found it it's a little panda i already went ahead and did my brows i kind of like them like the s shape you know for the brows i'm not really that good at explaining but basically all you do is you take don't tell me this is dry so basically, all you're gonna do is take your eyeshadow, pomade, whatever, and you just outline it. Okay, so I finished doing my brows, and this sucks. So I just did it with eyeshadow. Now that we're done with the brows, I don't know how I feel about them. They honestly come out different every single time. But then I'm gonna go in with primer. This is the e.l.f. This is the best primer, bro. But I'm running now and every time i go to the store there's never like everyone's a fiend for this okay we're gonna carve our brows out which is like my favorite part but at the same time like i hate it like whenever i mess up it just it annoys me so much but i'm using the elf hydrating camel concealer this is in the shade medium neutral but we're just gonna grab this angled brush and we're just gonna carve them out so normally I just go to the bottom first on both sides and then the top and I just connect them. And so now what I'm gonna do is get my concealer and just put some on my eyelid. Cause now we're gonna do lashes. And I used to put lashes on at the very end, but I don't know. It like switches, like sometimes I'll do it at the end and then sometimes I'll do it towards the beginning because i'll be feeling bald so i'm gonna just curl my lashes really quick and then i use this mascara the sky high one i'm gonna get my lashes prepared these are the lashes i use they're from amazon i'll put a link if you're wondering i'm gonna take some scissors and i'm gonna trim them because this is not gonna fit my whole eye and then i'm gonna use the duo lash glue i'm gonna just let them dry until they get tacky and if I like really want them to stay on all day, what I'll do is I'll put a thin layer of lash glue on my, like where you, where you place them, you know? Okay, these are the lashes. We can finally move on to my base. And for foundation, I use the L'Oreal in shade 480. And I'm gonna just put it straight on. Bro, I swear by this foundation, like, if you're looking for a good foundation, use that one. And I use this like broken brush to put it all over my face. Now we're just gonna blend this. Is my beauty blender dry? It kind of dried up. And I don't really focus on blending underneath my eyes because concealer is gonna go there anyway, so. 
Uh, this one, these ones look longer, huh? I hate when my eyelashes, like, they're always all the same, but they look like different styles, you know what I mean? So this is where I put my concealer, and I let it sit for like 10 seconds, because this concealer, like, it kind of dries fast, so. We're gonna do our contour now. I'm gonna use the Butter Bronzer in Deep Bronzer. I'm almost out. Contour is probably my favorite part, actually. Because it just like brings everything together. We're gonna contour our nose now. And I just grab um, an eyeshadow brush. I don't know. So two lines right here. We're gonna connect the two at the bottom. And then that line right there. And then what we're gonna do is with the same brush, we're gonna add some to our eye. And then you wanna like, whoa. You wanna like connect it like right here. I'm like right here. Oh my gosh. Also, I mean, I saw this TikTok and she said like to get a smooth base, you put setting spray after each step. So I don't use setting spray because I just don't know what to use. So if you have any recommendations, let me know because I want to see if I like it or if it like makes a difference, you know? People always ask me like, how do you get your makeup to stay on all day? And I'm like, I don't know. The primer? I don't know. And then with like any extra powder, I make sure to put it like on this area. And then I don't let it sit for too long. And then I'm gonna grab this fan brush if I could find it. Oh, it's right here. I'm just gonna like, like brush it off. And then with any extra powder, I just like pat it in. Okay, so we finished. And I'm gonna get back to you guys in a bit because I don't wanna put lips on or highlighter on until later so we can like last longer. But basically, the hairstyle I want to do is like the pearl headband thing. I don't want it to do like both sides. I only wanted to do one side. And so basically I already sectioned it. This is so hard to do. Like I cannot do hair. So hopefully this turns out good. But pff, look at that. I'm going to just curl the rest of my hair. And then I'm going to do this at the end. Um, I don't know if I'm going to put gel. Or just like put water in my hair. And then I'm going to put these in. Unos momentos después. Hey guys, so I finished doing my hair. I was gonna film me doing it, but you're like, this is how it turned out. I'm scared it's like gonna fall off because I had a bobby pin it. It kind of feels loose, but yeah. I'm on my way to Alyssa's. I'm gonna film at her house though because I still need that change because Daya's gonna bring a dress for me. I don't know where my lips went, my lip liner, so I'm gonna just borrow one of Alyssa's. But look, it's my outfit. Oh, hell no. I had to bring things for my friend and there's my mom she's bringing boots too so these tank less are for Daya so I just put them on because that would look weird if I was just in boots with this outfit so guys she's about to do my lashes so I'm at Alyssa's house now show her sorry say hi boo <laughs> okay so we're gonna be on our way soon and then Alyssa bro she looks good there's, there's, a the ass, there's a whole ass grass like around. My mind feels lost with no direction. My faith is shaken, but I need my head. Hey.